Okay, sorry about that. It looks like we got my frames fixed, but that was a good place to stop the first video anyways. So, just picked up that thing, and look at this! Biggest, best way to start the new video. Picking up a lantern. This thing's gonna be like my best friend in the world. I'm pretty much just gonna get rid of all my other friends. This lantern will always be at my side. You know, helping me out in scary moments. And look at this! Look at this! I wouldn't have seen that doorway without it. Actually, probably would have figured it out, but... Got some rocks that way, so I'm guessing we're not moving that way. Got kind of an old door here that I'm gonna have to ease open. Not a fan of doors I have to pull towards me, by the way. You know, makes it tough to hide. Oh, this can't be good. Judging from the way that's shaking, I'm guessing that was the building and not me. I wouldn't be surprised if Daniel got super scared and started shaking horrifically, but luckily, not me. Actually, luckily, I don't know about that. I prefer to be in like a stable building myself, but let's see what we got going on over here. Uh, do anything with this? No, unfortunately not. Imagining I could maybe like pick it up and you know carry it with me like, like a torch, but you know fire kind of burns your hands. Look at this! I, I want to sneak into this room, but I gotta open it slowly and then peer. In. Ooh, we got a desk, and it looks like whatever whoever thing we're f we were following. Looks like they came here too. And we got a fairly large room, but the music and the camera pointing this way makes me feel like I'd go here first. So it wants to make a mess of the place. 19th of August, 1839. Mm. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there will be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. <laughs> Easier I can't said tell than you why, but know this: I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. Mm. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still oh, fuck that bitter bastard. in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum. Find Alexander and kill him. Mm. His body is old and weak. And yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. Mm -hmm. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into mm -hmm. the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. Well then. Um, got some plot now, but that overall was kind of concerning. Um, evidently there's this douchebag, Alexander, some old man that's wrecking my life. Drove me to, you know, either, you know, pretty much drink something. You know, like Jaeger, I'd probably assume. That sounds like me. Till I forgot, and then, um... Oh, not that way. Oh, look at that! Oh my gosh, I want this in my heavy house someday. All minus the cockroaches and me wanting to you know, pee my pants all the time. But, but yeah, so we gotta go find Daniel. No, I'm Daniel. I already found me. Gotta go find Alexander, though kind of uh, ruined my life by the sounds of it and uh, need to screw him up pretty good but now we're in this entrance hall and got more light outside and I wish I could go out because that seems like a much nicer situation than in here and uh, you know this uh, looks like I've seen better days so let's stroll over here
Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking. Come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenburg. Well, oh man. So I guess I remember some things. I didn't drink the best of forgetting potions. Got what looks to be more blood here, but you know, I can't decide. At one point I thought it was rose petals. Might be either one. Probably not the most important thing though. Go with blood because that seems scarier and more their style. But you know, inner sanctum, probably you know, locked and everything. And let's be serious, I'm not in any rush to go down to where Alexander's hiding. But lamp oil and tinderbox, it's like my birthday. Also, I may have lied earlier, like tinder, ooh, more tinder. Their tinder box is cool. Lamp oil, like 18 times better. Oh, hot damn, more, more oil. Ah, this hall, like perfect. Let's see where this goes. Oh. Well, it doesn't go, and actually, it turns out it's. Got gross on it? I don't know. This. i jock it up to just me going crazy as Daniel. Because that's what Daniel would do. Either that or this castle's alive. But. I don't know that. And if it is, I'm pretty terrified. I'm gonna keep this rock with me from now on. Gonna rock Steve. So let's see. Go to the wine cellar, the laboratory. I could go upstairs. Well, let's see what's upstairs first. No, oh, Jesus! There's a lady. Unless Alexander, you know, really knows how to change his voice. Maybe she needs some help. I'm going to be, but Lambert, no, I really don't want to go there yet. That must be, no. Sorry, damsel in distress, but I've got to check out what else is around here first. Plus, considering all the weird things I've heard, now it's probably just me hearing things again. Let's do some running. The archives, or as the sophisticated people, the tabularium. Yep. I know how to say things, I guess. Hmm. Looks like I can get that, but hey, tinderbox. That's where I leave them. Right on the staircase, just in case. Let's see, we came from the old archives. We're going to go to the new archives what's in there. Another lone soul in London seemed appropriate somehow. That's how I feel every day now. Not the lonely soul part like I'm in London. Well, we got a change of sounds now. It's also, as usual, pretty dark. Uh, rare books. It's a good place to start. Just gonna bowl right into this room, you know, without fear. What we got here? What are you? The, the, the Fazanreich. Reich. But I don't know why. I'm not German. Um, but yeah, let's see. Also, we got a pretty sweet-looking skeleton dude. The scimitar. Yep, worthless. Ooh, papers. And glowing papers, you know. I trust those the most. 16th of May, 1839. 
Hmm, a story. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, ah, the Tim mother Hanan. of us all. He An doesn't sound like story a story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is oh, keeping probably, from me, the dig should like yield that. something interesting to take back to no, London itself, don't need the ice while Museum. recording. Sorry about that. So, there we go. I have a nice little story from my own diary, which I guess I'm a little fairy, but I keep a diary with me. From times I was an explorer. Hopefully exploring places a little less scary than this, but old tombs doesn't sound like a... I like to lead a boring lifestyle. Unfortunately, a whole lot of nothing in that drawer, so I think that's all that's in this room. We could go darkness, but I'm going to go with door I can see. Is there open? Appearance. Ah, we got dark room. Or, ooh, I see the name of it. Catalogs. Oh. That door is already open and I ran out of oil by the looks of things. That's, that's not a very good sign for me, but I'm going to try not to waste a tinder box. Oh, we got something from Wilhelm here. He's got contracts. He's going to offer his full attention and services to Alexander, uh, Baron of Brennenburg, naturally. He would call himself a Baron. Uh, three years long. <laughs> Evidently, he's giving up his freedom. That's good. He is going to get some kickbacks to be higher up in the royal court, it looks like. And something's about to order the Black Eagle. I'm gonna guess that's a different sanctum than the inner sanctum, but. Um. Yeah, but Wilhelm, the house of Garage, evidently thought Alexander was a, a trustworthy dude. Assuming he found out otherwise, but maybe only I was the one to find out otherwise, but who knows. More darkness, but a little bit of light here. Stand over here for a second. Really think this chair should be here, though. A little feng shui. Tasting some old art, I guess. And, uh, let's see what's in this door. Like a little bit of light. Looks like a cabinet where stuff might be. I don't know what that sound was, though. It sounded a little bit like a dying mule. Highly doubt there's one of those in here, though. Most likely a doorway was opening or closing somewhere. Um, finding a whole lot of nothing around here, though. Oh, never mind. I spoke too soon. Let's open this up. Eh, just kind of creaky. Seventeenth ah, May. more of my diary. Eighteen thirty-nine. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Mm, that's a shame. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. Mm. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. Mm. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue <coughs> down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely mm. carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. Mm. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with the statues unlike chamber, any I'd ever seen. 
<laughs> Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, Maybe a I great was buried slab there of once. stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. <gasps> I was trapped. Oh god, I hope I got out. But yeah, that was an interesting part of the story. Mm. <laughs> okay, but this seems like a good place to stop the video, so...